If a karmi sees a picture of Radha Krishna and feels an, an emotion of joy, admiration and appreciation of this picture, can this be called bhava bhakti? No. Bhava bhakti is something else. Bhava bhakti comes at the stage beyond a material attraction. So when one is, one is free from anartas, when one has crossed the anartha nivritti stage, then there is the question of bhava bhakti. He has some bhava, some feeling, some positive attraction, some emotion. That is very good. But bhava bhakti means when that is fixed. It's not just a fleeting emotion. If a Kanishta devotee who has faith in the supreme position of Krishna feels an emotion of joy, love and appreciation when seeing the deities, can this be called Bhava Bhakti? Again, no. Because Kanishta Adhikari means well, he has faith in the supreme position of Krishna but he, by definition he is Jaha Komal Shraddha Se Kanishta Jan. His faith is not very strong. So there's no question of Bhava, bhava bhakti means, again, not some fleeting emotions, but when one's uh, feelings are continuously flowing toward Krishna and not flowing toward Maya. That is the stage called bhava bhakti. Basically, how can we define bhava bhakti and can you experience even when you have a mundane material consciousness? Yeah, bhava bhakti is defined in Bhakti Rasamrita Sindhu as this, the stage where one's attraction flows towards Krishna. One is free from material attraction, but that has not yet fully matured into Prem. Can you experience it when, even when you have mundane material consciousness? We can experience feeling for Krishna. That is Krishna's mercy. But again, to be... It, until it's mature we can find that we have feelings for Krishna and then the next moment feelings for, strong feelings for Krishna and then just shortly afterwards strong feelings for Maya so that's not fixed more importantly how can a devotee transform his Bhava Bhakti to Shuddha Bhakti well first come to Bhava Bhakti and then, then we'll see Shuddha Bhakti the process is there from from the beginning. Bhava Bhakti matures into Prema Bhakti.